Hello and welcome back to Long War 2 Season 1. Now we were going to jump into another stealth mission, but I went ahead and I just did the mission and I didn't record it. And my thought process was we're going to have a lot of those kinds of missions coming up. And I think the ones that are interesting where we take two or three soldiers in are certainly worth, um, you know, worth recording and, and worth um, everyone taking a look at. But some of the solo ones where... I, I don't know. I'm kind, of, I'm kind of split on this. So here's the irony here, and I'll show you a couple screenshots. So I went and did this solo mission with with Fu, and I, I wasn't recording it. And the mission kind of went, um, it, it got a little bit crazy because I was discovered right at the data point, and then and then I was uh, basically having to just run for my life type deal with with Fu. And I, I managed to run essentially all the way across the map with virtually every pod chasing me and then reinforcements dropped um <laughs> as as i was trying to extract and and we were able to as you can see um and the mission was successful um and you know we're, we're back safely with foo and here's what we got for loot and what have you um but it raises an interesting question so here i make the decision that i'm not going to record every stealth mission and then i have a stealth mission that actually was kind of interesting so my question to all of you is, do you, and, and the reason I ask this is because I noticed some of the stealth missions don't get um, as much attention. I don't see as much in terms of the interest, the interest level doesn't seem to be as high. So if folks as a whole are not interested in seeing the stealth missions, then I don't have to show them all um, and therefore won't record all of them. And then I'll just sort of get back into, you know, traditional missions or what have you, or if you do want to see them, then let me know, let me know in the comments. Okay, but uh, so this was just sort of like an experiment with this one. Um, but in any case, let's move on. We're going to go back out to the Geoscape. Oh, we did pick up two power also because we got a point of interest reward off of that. So it ended up being an additional two power for the Avenger. All right, so let's go back out. I think the board's clear. Yeah, the board's clear. So traditionally, this episode would be a an operational update, but... We're going to try to just see if we can get ourselves a mission. Um, let's see. Haven's Advent strength is 5, 3, 4, and 6. Okay, we're going to scan down here. For South Africa. Acquired a new op. Okay. Operation Dawn Hawk to hack an Advent. <laughs> Why does it always have to be on the train? Like, why? I hate those missions. I do. I hate them. You know I do. All right. So, but we'll confirm this. Setting course for the Brazilian corridor. Let's grab the misfits. Okay. So that's who's available right now. Jackal and Apelis. Um, do we have another soldier that's just sort of like free range in it right now that's available? Um, we could send, we could send Lezrin with them. Yeah. Or we could send JP. Probably better to send JP actually. Yeah. Okay, so three days, ten hours is total infiltration time. Um, you know what? You should also carry an SMG. Like, just a regular SMG. Yeah. There we go. And... Let's get rid of some of this gear. Well, your mobility is pretty darn high anyway. And yours. Let's drop one of the flash. There we go. And JP, yours. Okay, and let's grab this promotion. Field medic, suppression, or airdrop. Um, hmm. Let's 
grab airdrop. Okay. Off you go. course for the South African sector. I am sure Baseless research. I've often wondered how Stiletto rounds. Based on our studies of alien physiology, this ammo will do bonus damage to non-robotic aliens. Oh, that's kind of cool. Chameleon suit. Are they merely another Tigan, shut up. Alien genetic tampering. While design will not afford any bonus protection, allows troops to blend in whatever environment they're operating in, reduce time necessary to infiltrate enemy targets. Oh! Okay, well that could potentially be really good for um, our rapid response team. Yeah, this would be good for Ed's team, potentially. So is this just, is it a replacement of the armor, or is it a... a small item slot? I'm assuming it's a replacement for the armor. We'll have to take a look at that. Okay, so what are we going to do now? Nope. We could do psionics research. Two alarium cores, though. Mm. Let's do viper autopsy. Although I would ex Although I had realistic expectations as to the limited resources and facilities available to me on board the Avenger, I have to say, it's taken some getting used to. So we've got. To AP rounds, mind shield, red screen rounds, shape charge, and tracer rounds available. Here's what we've got for weapon upgrades. Okay, so... Tygen, shut up, my lord! God! Okay, where is this chameleon suit? You need a faceless corpse for it, huh? Man, that thing is pricey. A faceless corpse, 30 supplies, 2 alloys, and an alarium core, and it takes 8 days? Wow, that thing's no joke. Yeah. Talon rounds. Battle scanners. I would, I'd really like to have a battle scanner. Money is so tight, though. Yeah, well, I'm grabbing one. Sounds good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. Commander? Red screen rounds is a drone wreck and five supplies. Huh. Racer rounds, five supplies, and one Illyrium crystal. Grab a set of those too. I think Dad would have been proud. Just buy like these little like incremental the upgrades. First time in a long time, we're actually a threat to the aliens, and they know it. What's with all the talking? Now Shush it up. Rescue VIP from Advent Vehicle. Mm. Uh. Okay, who do we have? With what? With two days? Yeah, let them let them have it. Matter of fact, we should be scanning somewhere else. We're doing what? Recruitment here? Who's set to intel? You are? And you're hiding, right? You're set to recruitment. Alright, let's go back Stay over to New Brazil, Brazil. And scan there. Okay, so what we want here is resistance comms. 125 bucks. We've got 60 right now. Okay. We got two gremlins available. So, let's see. What do we want to do then? I guess go ahead and assign another one here. 
Because why not? I got questions about why did I put a power relay here, and I guess my response to that is, you know, um, I, I could have waited and, and potentially put it, say, down a level, but why? Based on the number of points of interest power that we've picked up, plus the fact that this power relay can be manned by gremlins, plus the power relay can be upgraded, plus it can be upgraded again in terms of its efficiency, right? Because we can add another workstation, which adds more power, and we can upgrade the power relay itself. I, I think that this one power relay manned by gremlins is all the power we're going to need. It, maybe not, but we'll, we'll see. But I'm comfortable with my decision to put a, a power unit here. Um... All right, back out. Ah, yes. Okay, good, good, good. I had assigned a higher level soldier over here. I think Wolfric, actually. Yeah, I think so. All right, let's go do this. Setting course for sector 13. So now I don't know, but I think we might actually get two fa both faceless on this, which would be great. Bastards been taking our money. Does that person have a laser weapon? And if so, how did they get it? Did you guys see that? <laughs> like, how did you get that? Do they do they get do the Haven folks get like incremental upgrades based on tech level? Oh, maybe they do. Maybe they do. An advent spy has been tracked to a meeting site within, with enemy forces. In a short window to interrupt this meeting and eliminate both the spy and their handlers, we have no time for the Avenger to send in regular XCOM forces. A small number of resistance personnel have volunteered to take up arms with the Haven's ad, um, advisor to eliminate the threat. Be advised, it may take even longer than usual for the Sky Ranger to arrive from his evac. Understood. We'll take by surprise. Understood. A hell of a lot easier. That's right. That's right. Okay, where are you bastards at? We're coming for you! That's like a bad... Actually, I was like trying to do battle music, and that was more like bad 60s television spy show. Sorry. Let me let me try something else here. That's a little bit better. Not much. I'll stick to being an XCOM commander. I'm not trying to write songs. Though it's my understanding that many of you love my love my singing voice. Yeah, that seems to be the general consensus. <laughs> oh jeez. I crack myself up sometimes. Yeah, look! Look! What is this? What do you have? A laser sten gun. I knew I saw a laser weapon, so they do get upgrades. I think it's kind of funny though, that she's got a laser sten gun and we don't even have that tech. But we went a tier above that, remember? We have mag weapons, so... That's really interesting. Let's go. Old Wolfric. Old Wolfric. Why are you such a badass? I don't even think he knows. Get it done. He just is. Getting it done. Getting it done. Yeah, he just is. Like the sky is blue and water's wet. Moving out. Wolfric's a badass. That's right. That's how that goes. Alright, so who do we got here? Is that person's name Fungal? Is that an L or an I? F fungi? Wow. That's just an unfortunate name altogether. We've got Raffia, Andrea, Elizabeth. Oh yeah, SK. I remember SK. SK's got. What do you have, buddy? You got a laser rifle. Wow, you guys are awesome. Huh. We've yet to see an upgraded weapon in the game, like, actually in a fight. So this is kind of interesting. Got it moving. Still nothing? Wow. 
Moved quite a bit of territory here. Go, go, go. Moving to designated coordinates. Alright, Wolfric. Confirm. Up. SK. I'm all over it. Moving to Overwatch. Up we go. Keep moving. Spotted enemy. Really? Oh, I'm so tempted to install that mod that would prevent that kind of nonsense. Let's see. So if we drop here, you'll be able to come over here and flank. Mm. All right, let's hold that thought here for a moment. What's over there? Alright, flash those two guys. Thank you. The only reason I'm actually not going ahead and installing that mod... We keep moving. Um, and I forgot the name of it off the top of my head, but... Um, it's because I don't like to add any mods during a campaign. As a matter of fact, I've mentioned this a couple times, I've actually got someone who's really good at INI &I edits and experimenting with mods. As a matter of fact, he's got a YouTube channel where he basically, that's pretty much what he does. Um, his name is Talem. You guys know him from the XCOM roster, or you should. And he's actually helping test all kinds of stuff for Season 2 right now. Nice guy to help me out with that kind of stuff. Very nice guy. Okay, that'll work. Is that environmental going to blow up, or is that just actual cover? Apparently it will blow up. <laughs> oh, that was good. I'm on it. Scanning. Whatever you say. Moving to Overwatch. How did I know? How did I know he was gonna make that shot? How did I know? That's just crazy. Just crazy. Going after him. Roger. Position. Close that distance. One of you guys. You guys, the faceless. Both you guys, faceless. I'm assuming they are, because they're... Yeah, look at that. Yeah. Alright. Hi there. Got a dead Check alien for intel. Here. Okay, so let's see. And... I hope it's let's get in a position to be able to take some shots, shall we? Heading out. Up. Okay, I'll go. Forward. Up. Roger that. Oh, what happened here? <laughs> What's over there? Ah, there was, I was like, we can go up here and open the door, but apparently that's not... Uh, that's not a requirement so at this point. Right yep, here we go. Hello, Evil Gumby. Now, the other one as well, I'm assuming? Because he was... Yeah. Hello, other evil Gumby. So that's cool. Two of them. Yeah. 
Not gonna run close enough to be in range? Yeah, there you go. There we go. Good job, folks. Come to me. Come to me. Alright, so let's see. How do we want to do this? I think we back up. Mm-hmm. I'd like to get Wolfric out of this without him getting hurt, and right now he's not, so my moves are going to be primarily predicated upon that. Nice shot. some of these shots to hit people. Draining mm. ammo fast. That's that wasn't ideal. That was not ideal. Locked and loaded. Weak hit. Could use some ammo over here. Love a shot from here? Yeah, you do. Okay, Moving drop. Yeah, I think the safer bet is to flashbang that thing. Oh man, I'm not wild about this at all. Darn it, Wolfric's gonna get shot at anyway. Damn it. Well, don't have a choice now. There you go. Nice. Good job. Welcome to Noble Team. I'm on it. They got me zeroed. Jump down. Here, catch. Yep, enjoy that. Nice. What can we do? Can you get close enough? Hmm. You, you know what? So. Move there. Toss smoke. Go get that loot. 
Advanced stock, okay, oh, nice. I'm going. Yeah, we can flash one of them. All right. Good look. On the move. Seems doable. On Overwatch. Moving back, huh? Okay. Whoa. Not even close. That was close. Heading out. Move up. Need a light. Flash that guy. Oh, Frank. We're moving out. Kiss this guy good night. <laughs> and we'll get some more loot. Magazine. I hope it's worth it. Come get some. All right, I'll go. Overwatch. Mm -hmm. Any decent forward positions? Yeah, that's twice. fine right there. PCS combat awareness. We've got a bunch of PCS modules. Which is nice. Confirm. Hello there. Good night. All too easy. Positive confirmation. Area secured. Status confirmed. That's right. Nice. High fives. Operation Doom Beast. Boo. Good work out there, Commander. The aliens must be in Oh, we got a promotion, nice. Band stock, combat awareness, and we got some corpses. Hey, that's nice. Oh yeah, that's that mission we passed up on. Oh, okay, so now, since there's no faceless here, and what are you guys doing there? Supply? Well, I'm not giving you an engineer, but I will give you another soldier. Uh, the question is who? Um, hmm. Uh, you guys can have Rusty for now. Yeah, okay, so see, this is what I'm talking about with the whole hiding thing. What's, what's, what exactly is the point of doing that? So it went down one and then popped right back up, so I don't really see the point in the whole hiding thing. If somebody's got some actual keen insight into that, like what's what's the real value there? Because I'm not I'm not seeing it. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm not. Okay, so let's go back out this way then. Setting course for sector three, Brazil.
Supply raid. Mm hmm. Operation Ice Queen, huh? Hmm. What do we have? Can we send. Ed's almost done with his shredder training. I might wait a day and then send them. Or I might send Xeno Squad instead. I don't know. I'm going to think about that a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and wrap this episode up here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider hitting that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. Till next time, I'm Mal, and I will see you later.